go to a zoo to see things that you don't see in your daily life. Uh, you get to see at a regular zoo the elephants and the gorillas. You come to the petting zoo here and you get to see the exotic large insects that you don't see and I think there's a fascination to see things live up close and personal. People who are interested in, in insects are quite excited about having the opportunity to see some that they maybe haven't seen before or that they don't see on a daily basis. At the petting zoo, basically, you get to see uh, all kinds of arthropods. For example, we have uh, the tarantulas, which are spiders. We have the millipedes. We do have the insects, of course, the large Madagascar uh, hissing cockroaches, many of the large walking sticks. Uh, we have caterpillars out of the hornworm colony. So there are a number and a range of insects and their cousins that you would see in the petting zoo. But we do see as people go through the petting zoo that they become more and more inclined to touch something that they decided up front that they didn't really want to touch. 